السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ابو حریرہ رضی اللہ تعالیٰ عنہ ریویلڈ دیٹ وین اے پرسن ریسائٹ لا الہ الا اللہ محمد الرسول اللہ اللہ عرش ان فرنٹ آف دیٹ دیئر از اے اسپیشل ان لائٹڈ پلر دس پلر اسٹارٹ آسیلیشن ٹو اینڈ فرو موشن اللہ سیز ٹو اٹ اسٹاپ بٹ دس پلر نیور اسٹاپ ہی ریکویسٹ اللہ آئی ول اسٹاپ وین دا پرسن ہو ریسائٹڈ لا الہ الا اللہ محمد رسول اللہ وین ہیز سینز ول بی فار گیون دین آئی ول اسٹاپ دین اللہ کمانڈ کومس ٹو دیٹ ون دیٹ وی ہیو فار گیون دا سینز آف دیٹ پرسن دین دس اسپیشل ان لائٹڈ پلر اسٹاپس آسیلیٹنگ One other hadith, Holy Prophet ﷺ said, when a person is just to recite La ilaha illallah one time even, Allah, will, Allah forgives all the sins of that person also. And in other hadith it comes that when a person recite La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah, this kalma, when a person recite, Allah makes a special type of green bird. This green bird is with white arms and has 10,000 head and in her head, in every head, there are 10,000 mouths and in every mouth there are 10,000 tongues. And in every tongue, there are 10,000 languages. And this bird, in these 10,000 languages, make tasbih of Allah and request for forgiveness of that person who recited La ilaha illallah Muhammadur Rasulullah. So, Allah says the angels to say this bird to visit paradise. This bird never goes there. This bird request Allah, I will not go for walk in the paradise until you will forgive the person who recited La ilaha illallah. So then message comes to this world, we have forgiven that person who recited La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah. MashaAllah, this hadith is revealed by Abu Huraira Razi Allah Ta'ala Anhu. One uh, villagers came to Holy Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam when Holy Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam telling the people about different advices. When Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam he finished, then this person he requested Holy Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam that I am so much sinful person and my sins are more than the stars. He said, my sins are more than, than the particles of sand. Then he said, my sins are more than the drops of rain. Then he said, my sins are more than the leaves of the trees. Then Holy Prophet ﷺ said, Is, are your sins are more than the mercies of Allah. Then he started crying. Holy Prophet wasallam said to him, You recite La ilaha illallah, then Allah will forgive all of your sins. Think now. Reciting La ilaha illallah, it is the source 
for forgiveness of the sins even the sins are too much similarly when a person is when a person is reciting la ilaha illallah muhammadur rasulullah when an angel take this deed towards allah he found he finds other angel who is coming down and when they talk the other angel tells that i have the command of allah for freedom from the hell for that person allah has forgiven all the sins of that person who has recited la ilaha illallah muhammadur rasulullah One person came to Holy Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam he said I buried seven girls in my house Holy Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam became silent Jibril alaihi salam came with the command of Allah he said Allah has forgiven the sins of this person of his 60 years all the biggest sins and all types of sins what this person has done allah has forgiven him because of reciting la ilaha illallah muhammadur rasulullah ma sha allah so la ilaha illallah muhammadur rasulullah is the source of forgiveness of the sins of a person sheikh abu yazid qurtubi rahmatullah alaihi said that i heard that when a person recites la ilaha illallah muhammadur rasulullah 70000 times allah will give that person freedom from the hell fire ma sha allah we try to recite la ilaha illallah muhammadur rasulullah as much as in order to refresh and refine our iman we request allah to save our iman and to protect it from all types of enemies and help us to stay with iman and to die with iman so that we should have a good face before you at the day of judgment amen